The overall goal of this procedure is to simulate rainfall having a standard drop size, intensity, and uniformity across the target area to study soil runoff. This is accomplished by first adjusting rainfall simulator controls to achieve the approximate pressure and flow rate for the selected nozzle. The second step is to calibrate the rainfall simulator to achieve the exact flow rate for the selected nozzle and a uniform distribution of raindrops across the target area. Next, properly packed soil boxes are positioned in the target area on a platform adjusted to a uniform slope. The final step is to conduct a rainfall simulation and collect soil runoff for analysis. Ultimately, rainfall simulation is used to study the effects of soil properties, soil amendments, antecedent soil moisture, topography, and rainfall intensity on soil runoff under standard conditions that approximate natural rainfall. This video depicts a rain simulation protocol that's been used around the world to consistently evaluate runoff from soils. So demonstration of this method is important because rainfall simulator operation and calibration involve many steps. Also, there are many variables which can influence the results. Peter will be demonstrating the procedure for packing the soil boxes. Peter's a student at the University of Maryland Eastern Shore. He's worked in my lab for the last four years. Begin the protocol by procuring boxes of identical dimensions. These boxes are 100 centimeters long, 20 centimeters wide, and 7.5 centimeters deep, and have nine 5 millimeters.